Hey guys, so last Friday I posted a little video about something that was on my heart that week that was being at a crossroads and how I typically tend to handle that, which for me simply boils down to a matter of perspective, right? Uh, but I got a lot of inbox messages about that and that was really, that was really cool um, that just sharing another side of myself with y'all, actually the foundation of who I am with you guys would be helpful. And I like that conversation. I like this sense of community. So I thought I'd share what I've been learning and what's been on my heart this week. And I hate to say this, I hate to say this so much, but it's, uh, it's comparison. And I hate this so much because I never usually struggle with this. I'm a pretty self-confident person. So I usually don't focus on what other people are doing. I focus on what I'm doing and who I wanna become using my specific set of gifts and talents. Like a flower doesn't think about competing with the flower next to it, right? It just blooms. So we have Facebook though, and we have Instagram, and we scroll through these posts and other people's highlight reels, and it's hard to not internalize that sometimes, right? Like if my highlight reel doesn't look as good as their highlight reel, I must be behind, whatever that means. But you know what, that's all that is, is just a highlight reel. You don't see the sweat of the execution, you don't see the late nights, the after hours, the sacrifices, the loneliness that are all a part of that roller coaster ride. We are only privy to the highlight reel. And comparison is such a thief of joy. It's the whole grass is greener concept where we're so busy focusing on somebody else's grass that we forget to water our own yard. And life's not easy, okay, for any of us. So at least give yourself a break and don't make the little things big things, right? Because you're gonna wake up to a new challenge every day anyways. Look at this hair. I wake up, look at this, I wake up to an uphill battle every single morning. But while I'm over here wishing for hair that would just for once just do the same thing every day and just lay there, those of you who have hair that does the same thing every day and you can't get any variation are telling me that you want hair more like mine. God bless your soul, but it's true. So what I'm over here having to remind myself is to not confuse the tip of the iceberg that I see of someone else's life with their reality. Don't give that self-consciousness and envy a foothold. What am I, what are you supposed to do? What is your life's work? Invent yourself, then reinvent yourself. And for God's sake, stay out of the clutches of mediocrity. Oscar Wilde says that to live is the rarest thing, that most people simply exist and that is all. And none of us just wanna simply exist. And what I've come to realize is that comparison is something that can produce fear, self-doubt, overanalyzation, and paralyze you quicker than just about anything else. So that's my inner monologue this week. <laughs> Some of you guys need to adopt it. Go right on ahead, I'm right there with you. Uh, but regardless, I love you guys. I'm grateful for you, and I hope you all have amazing weekends. Go be great.